Hey guys, it's Carolina here from Carolina's Crafts and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have another project share to share with you guys. And if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys know I've been working on this for like the past week. Um, it's been a process guys, but I filmed the whole process for you guys as well, which took that much longer, but I filmed it for you guys. So that will be coming starting, um, in the next video and then throughout the week so you guys could check out the links in the description box down below but they won't be posted until that date and if there is no date that means they're already posted it just depends on when you're watching this but i finished my engagement photo album guys and i can't wait to show you guys so let's get right into it because i'm super duper excited Oh my gosh, it's done. It's done. It's beautiful. It turned out better than I had imagined. And all right, let's get started. Okay, guys, so we did the base in part one of the video, but I did not do the decorating on the front. But this is what it looks like. It says, she said yes. Oh, I love that cut apart. And this is actually not from the same collection, but you guys will see that also in the video, in the process video. I decorated with some flowers. These are some Prima flowers and some Little Birdie Crafts flowers. I have a doily back here. I've got these glitter um, enamel dots. I've got stitching on the cut apart. And I have this little like typewriter that says our story. And it's the background of the paper is like this ring, um, diamond ring paper. It's got a seam binding closure. I've got a faux leather spine, guys. Like, that is so new to me. But I love it. And then here is the back, just like a floral paper. And you guys will see why I chose to do this one on the back um, when you guys see the process video. Okay, so... When we open this cutie up, again, you've got the seam binding closure, which I'm going to link in the description box down below. This is what it looks like. Okay, so here I just have our first, our very first date kind of information of like where this all started. So I have this little like um, closure and then it's a photo, our first date photo. And then this is still part of our first date. And then I just wrote about it in the background with a little oopsies um, because I may or may not have spilled my drink all over my babe <laughs> that first date. <laughs> so I just wanted to make sure to like put that in there. And I'm trying to show you guys the best way possible so you guys don't get a glare. Um, so I wanted to make sure to put that in there of kind of like how this all started and how we came to then getting engaged and then eventually there'll be a wedding album as well but here I have this page which is the like the engagement kind of ring the diamond ring I love that I put it on some acetate and right behind that I have the photo of where babe proposed so that's that photo and you guys could see I'm midair jumping up with joy so it's a great captured photo. Um, I have uh, foam stickers here that say love and this is a photo frame from the same collection. I just love it all. So then the next page here we just took a couple of photos after I said yes obviously and I have this that says she said yes and a little bit of like photo decorating down here. Um, this and then here I have our story of like how that all happened and how we even got this photo and the whole situation with the photo camera timer and all that. So I just have that written on here with like a he, he said she's or he asked and she said kind of um, cut apart. Then on this next page, this flips out and here I have this. So this is documented. And in here, I also have a photo strip right behind this library pocket. And that's what that looks like. So these photos we did not take. There was actually a photographer just that just so happened to be at the park. She was taking photos of her kids and then saw my babe propose and then took a couple of photos of us. So I just wrote that here in the little backstory, just made a little 
booklet and just kind of wrote that down here so that it lives in there then we celebrated by having some sushi so again i have this like like a little photo closure and i just wrote about that underneath here and this is our photo of our sushi celebration and obviously i had to like have my left hand on babe to kind of show off the ring even though you can't see it in here <laughs> um and then it says smile and then in this i have this photo that says he put a ring on it so later that night i had to make myself a new mug and this is also the photo that i used to post on instagram that i'm finally engaged and then it just says we're getting married so super duper cute then here i have kind of like our love story so i just printed and foiled all of our first our first hello first date first kiss first i love you our first year and then the proposal date and then this next page is just blank because i didn't want to add anything behind this i wanted this to be kind of clear then here uh, we celebrated also my parents bought some champagne a couple of days later so we celebrated with that and you could see i'm wearing sweatpants a sweater and some super fuzzy socks i was not expecting this to kind of be happening i knew babe was coming over but i didn't know that we were going to celebrate with champagne so it just kind of happened like that but it's fine um then here this is a uh, another page from a different collection that's just in my stash and it says love story it was like a full-size layout i cut it down to kind of fit in here then here we started taking our engagement photos which was months later but they're still going in this album because it's our engagement photo series it's probably the photo that we're going to use when we send out our like save the date invitations and whatnot um and definitely ones that I'm going to like blow up and print and have in our house once we have one. So here we're just on the beach taking a couple of photos. My sister was taking them for us. She was our photographer, which was great. Um, and Jaden was sitting in a stroller nearby. <laughs> and he was like a little baby then, so he wasn't talking or anything. He was just chilling. Um, so we we're just taking some photos and then babe wanted to throw me in the water so we got some laughs here super cute photos guys maybe i should zoom in just a little bit super cute and then here i have it says you and me and i have this tag in here um with our story kind of just like how babe was trying to throw me in the water so that's that right there then this next page um I have this larger photo and I just put finders keepers um, because I found babe and I'm keeping him and then love this life and this is our photo and I love 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 this photo it's like one of my favorites this is probably one I'm gonna blow up in our house and have like a giant photo of um, displayed and then here I have like this lips um, uh insert that i kind of made so it's like lips and it has um a foiled not foiled like a vellum a holographic glittery kind of vellum on top of it for like i don't know the decoration of the lips and then it says this is us and then inside of here i kind of have our story about our first kiss so although it's an engagement album i liked going back um to talk about like kind of where it all began and i'm not going to show you guys that because I'm sure um, you guys don't want to know our first kiss story, but also because Babe would probably kill me if I shared because it was like the funniest thing ever. So um, that just lives in here. And then this page, this uh, paper is not from this collection either. I just had to pull from my stash. Then here it says love, just a sticker from the collection. And I made this cut apart that says so in love with you. And I actually wrote a poem about how babe proposed <laughs> so it says he got down on one knee and she jumped with glee he was counting down 10 seconds for the camera to capture the perfect memory in the form of a picture before he could ask and say a word still jumping she said you didn't ask yet <laughs> she waited and waited for him to say during the longest 10 seconds on that sunday but then he did he did and said will you marry me so it's just, I'm not good at poems, guys, but I really wanted to write a poem kind of to capture how that whole thing went down. Um, it was cute. It was totally us. 
and I loved it. So I just wanted to capture that in the form of a poem, which is also just a little bit cuter. Even though I had the story um, here anyway, there was a backstory in here as well as the photographers that were there. But even though I had the story written, I just wanted to also write it in the form of a poem. So I included that in here and made that little cut apart. Um, then here I have another photo of us. And then here, this is another paper that's not from this collection, and it says Truly, Madly, Deeply. And here I have Kisses Forever, just a little bit of decorating. It's so cute, guys. I love this. I'm so happy we took some engagement photos, too. Then here it says True Love, and here I have this that opens up, and it says I Heart You, and we're laughing here. There's a whole story to this photo as well while trying to take our engagement photos and that just tucks back in here. And then the stories are on these tags. So they pull out and there's um, stories on both of those. And then this also flips open like so. And here we have another photo. And this is like goes with this, with this as well. Um, and it says you are everything and then here's a cut apart from I think this is from the wedding bliss or no This is wedding day collection and it says I love you without knowing how or when or from where I love you Straightforwardly without complexities or pride So I love you because I know no other way than this where I does not exist nor you um, And then there's the name Pablo Neruda who wrote that I guess um, but that's also from the collection. That's from the Wedding Day collection. I use like cut aparts from Wedding Day, Wedding Bliss, and then Happily Ever After also. So just different um, collections. So that closes back up like that. Then this next page looks like this. It says true love is when both people think they're the lucky one. I do have a tag in here. Nothing written on here though. Um, I don't, I have some kind of empty space here. I don't have all like photos filled up. And then here I have a tuck spot that says we're engaged. So I have like this ring, a heart and things that you can write on the back side, and then a journal card, which nothing is written on those yet. But I'll probably go back and add something like what I thought after the first day I met him, etc. Just kind of those things. Um, here we have another photo and it says capture the love best day ever and then this is decorated with a key to like your heart and then there is a frame layered behind there that says kiss your face and it's cute so there's that photo there then on this next page it says I don't have anything here and then here it says we go together like pancakes and syrup and this is a little notebook, which I don't have anything in here either. And I don't know, I'm almost considering maybe just cutting this out and using it in something else because I have nothing to add in here. Um, so we'll see. Then here it says you and me, um, just love. And there's another photo here, which is different from that other one, different position, different legs and whatever, but I still wanted to include in here. It's similar, but different. So it's still in here to capture all the love. Then here, this is Babe and I being silly and laughing. And while we were trying to take this kind of photo, Babe licked my hand instead. And then we just started um, laughing so hard. So then we got some laughing photos and those turned out really, really cute. Um, so I love that. I love all the silly moments. So I had to make sure to document them and include them in here also. So then here, <laughs> it was so funny because Babe was like, maybe I could take some better photos instead of waiting to get the perfect photo. So Babe took out his um, phone and for now we're taking a selfie with my sister taking a photo of us taking a selfie. So that was so fun. Um, it says best day ever and hey they're handsome. I have this other cut apart that says love you with all my heart. And then this flips. I have a tag in here that says loves in bloom but I don't have anything written on here either. Um, then it says you hold the key to my heart. Here I just have some photos that I printed at first which are already blown up um, in the album but I thought I was going to use the smaller size at first. I didn't so I ended up just um, including that in here. 
just a little extra bit and then here I made another little cut apart that says love of my life and then inside of here it just says um, have I told you yet how much you mean to me have I told you yet about all the happiness you bring have I told you yet that you mean the world to me just in case I haven't I want you to know that you are the best thing that's ever happened to me I love you um, so just a little kind of note which is probably what I'll go back and do on all like the other journal spots that I don't have anything written on. I just don't, I really don't know what to do on this one because there's so many pages in here that I included. Um, but I don't know. We'll see what to do on that. If you guys have any ideas, let me know. Um, I don't have any more photos though. So, okay. So we're back here. Then this next page, I have this photo of us sitting on a bench and it says forever and always. And then I don't have anything in this envelope here either, but I'm trying to find the little like parking ticket from the day that Babe proposed and that's gonna go in here once I find that. And I hope I do find it um, because I seem to have misplaced it. Um, so I hope it turns up before um, all the ink off of it disappears because I needed to scan it. But anyway, so that's in here. And I was thinking if anything, um, I don't know, maybe we could start including our, like maybe I could later on include our save the date invitation, which I'll probably keep two, one for here and then one for the wedding album as well. And then this is just the back page. There's nothing on here. Um, but yeah, that is my engagement album. Let me know what you guys think of this cutie. I had so much fun making it. And I'm so happy to finally have made something like for me. I've been putting it off for a really long time um, just because I've been busy with everything else and making albums for everybody else. But I'm happy I finally got around to doing this one. I do have a couple of other ones I still need to make for uh, me and then another one I need to make for my family. Um, so hopefully I'll get those done eventually too, but I still also want to get in some that I can make for you guys and to sell them. So that is everything. Stay tuned for the process videos. There's part one, two, three, and four. It's going to be a lot of videos, but it'll be going up after this video over the course of the week. So I hope you guys enjoy that. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope it was nice seeing like a finished album with like photos this time because I normally don't make things for me so when you guys ask me to put photos in it it's like uh, I don't make things for me I make them for everybody else so that I don't often put photos in these kinds of things because I normally don't make them for me um but this is one where it was for me so I was able to show you guys with some photos so I hope you guys liked it and I'll see you guys in my next crafty video so stay tuned and I'll talk to you next time Bye.